Storm Shield weather, certified most accurate. All righty, good evening, everybody. Hope you had a great Tuesday. It's a quiet and cool night in McAllister tonight. They should bottom out in the lower to mid 40s overnight tonight. Here in town, though, I think we'll hit the upper 30s. It's going to be a chilly start to tomorrow thanks to the dry air and also the clear skies that we do have above us uh, this evening. The winds have really calmed down. That's the good news. They're calm in some areas, otherwise out of the west at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. That's mainly how they'll stay through tomorrow, so a lot less wind tomorrow, that's for sure. Check out the highs across northeastern Oklahoma from today. Mid to upper 70s. Hit 79 today in McAllister and Muskogee. 76 here in town. The same in Bartlesville and 70 degrees earlier today in Ponca City. Right now it has cooled off. Again, temperatures are dropping pretty quickly. 58 right now in Tulsa, 59 McAllister, 56 in Vanita, and even some 40 showing up now to the west of I-35. It's going to be a pretty chilly night. Thanks to this dry air that we have in place, still relative humidity values to around 20 to 30 percent, so a pretty dry out there. Storm shield radar is clear. We're just seeing a few high thin clouds off to our west. That's about it. As high pressure starts to build in, we'll see mostly clear skies overnight tonight. There's a cold front that moved through earlier this morning. It's way down to our south and east. As you can see, some rain associated with this low pressure system over towards Chicago. Behind that, high pressure taking its place. That's going to settle in over the next couple of days until our next disturbance arrives toward the end of the work week. 76 officially at the airport today. That's well above our average of 62, and our record was 84 set back in 2013. We bottomed out at... 55 earlier this morning and will be a lot colder than that as you're waking up tomorrow morning. Here's a look at your day planner to plan out your Wednesday. 39 to start things off by 7 a.m. 10 up to 49 with mostly sunny skies by noon. 60 degrees and around 4 p.m. Uh, topping out around 73. So it should be a beautiful day. Anything outdoors. Again, a lot of sunshine and some relatively light westerly winds only about five to ten miles per hour. Let's take a look at future track now. Again, we stay dry for the next couple of days and even St. Patrick's Day. The rain staying well down to our south, although I think we'll see a little bit more in the way of cloud cover for Thursday afternoon. But again, it won't be too bad at all for Friday. That's when our system starts to move in. The rain arrives toward the morning hours on Friday and then that system moves on through during the during the day Friday. Not going to be a whole lot of rain. It's about a 40% chance, but there will be some rain around for most of the day Friday. Notice this model brought in some mixed precipitation, some snow even in our far northern areas. Again, I'm not buying that. I think this model is going a little bit too cold. But nonetheless, this system moves out of here by Friday night. And I think Saturday will be dry for the most part with mostly sunny skies. So for tonight, pretty chilly. 39 in town, 34 overnight in Bartlesville, 34 in Ponca City, 38 tonight in Stillwater. And a low 40s down to the south and east of Tulsa. Again, mostly clear skies. For tomorrow, a beautiful day. Get out there and enjoy it if you can. It'll be like today, but a little cooler and way less wind and a lot of sunshine. 73 is what I'm going with here in town. 70 degrees tomorrow in Bartlesville. 75 in the McAllister area. Topping out in the mid to upper 60s off to our north and east tomorrow. Again, sunsets at 732. Now, here's the official St. Patty's Day forecast for Thursday. Should be a good one. 68 degrees, mostly sunny. Again, we'll continue with those lighter winds for Thursday as well. Next seven days, we'll continue to see that rain chance for Friday, a 40% chance, 59 degrees. And the weekend should be just cool. 56 for Saturday, 61 for the first day of uh, spring on Sunday. Early next week, back up in the 70s. But again, we'll have to keep a close eye on Saturday night into early Sunday as we'll get close to a freeze. Not in my forecast officially, but I'm going with 35. I have to, have to, have to uh, watch that pretty closely. Right, cool is okay. I'm not yeah. with cold right now. Cool, Al. man. Cool. <laughs> Got to keep it cool. Weekends, right? Yeah. yeah.